I'm always going back in time and like pulling things back, back into the present. It's really like trying to make sense of your own history in a way. In my late teens, I started picking up a camera and uh, photographing kind of ordinary scenes that seemed to me charged with something. When I started painting, I looked for a subject matter, so I looked through my archive of images, particularly an unmade bed. I remember that it was the end of a relationship, and so it, it seemed to me very powerful, even though it was an ordinary scene. So I took that into my painting practice and started building on images that kind of sparked a memory or took me back in time. I was always drawn to abstracting things and because Polaroid's abstract reality. You're trying to visualize things that you can't grasp in any other way. In terms of the way that I paint, is I engage in a lot of you know, erasure, I put things on, and there is kind of conflict, there is stoppage, there is flow, so there's a lot of movement. The paintings in the show, A Dream Of, are all based on memories of dreams. The, the interest in dreams is related to my interest in the bed. And sleep in particular I find fascinating because um, we spend so much time sleeping. And it's, a, and it's an area that we don't really explore, or it's kind of a sort of like a wasteland that we don't access. So I like to explore it. I like to bring stuff up. I based the, the paintings on dreams that were so visceral that they kind of remain with me to this day. I had this one dream where plants were growing out of my teeth. I still kind of have it in front of me till this day. I try and encapsulate the feeling of a dream, the sense of a dream. I had my best dreams probably when I was the most disturbed as a person, which was in my teens. Growing up in Switzerland, I was born to a um, family of immigrants. Both my parents came from Hungary in 56. They fled the political troubles. So it was a sort of unhappy home. And I spent a lot of time on my own. And even though it was difficult, it taught me to live in my imagination and make alternate worlds. It's, it's wonderful. It saves our lives, Art, I think. <laughs> Saved my life.